Aluminium styles which replaced the Aspen and GLX models. In August 2000, the Galaxy received a facelift with new exterior, incorporating new edge and interior styling, including a new dashboard. 9. The updated trims included the LX, the Zetec, and gear. Contrary to the name, the Zetec was not available with a Zetec engine but with the 1.9 TDI engine which was supplied by Volkswagen, as well as Ford's own 2.3 petrol. 10. In 2004, the Galaxy received a very minor facelift. With new taillights, a new lower front grille and a few differences to some trims. As well as this, the Silver Special Edition was launched alongside the Mondeo Silver both having alloy wheels and only being available in three different silver colors. 11. Preface Lift, 1995 to 2000, 6, 7, 9, 12. Face Lift, 2000 to 2006, 10, 13. Aspen LXLX, 1999. Silver Ox Zetec Zetec, 1999. Gear Psy Gear Gear X Ultima. Gallery Galaxy MKI 1995-2000 Galaxy MKI 1995-2000 Galaxy MK2 2000-2004 Galaxy MK2 2000-2004 Galaxy MK2 2000-2004 Galaxy MK2 2000 2004 Galaxy MK2 2004 to 2006 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 Second generation 2006 Second generation, MK3, Ford Galaxy 2 Front 20100815. JPG. Preface Lift, 2006 2010. Overview Production June 2006 2015. Assembly Belgium, Genk, GB and A. Russia, Ilapuga, Ford Solace. Body and chassis related for Des Max Ford Mondeo powertrain engine petrol. 1.6L EcoBoost Turbo I4. 2.0L Duratec I4. 2.0L EcoBoost Turbo I4. 2.3L Duratec I4. Flex of fuel. 2.0L Duratec I4. Diesel. The second generation Galaxy was introduced at the 2006 Geneva Motor Show and went on sale alongside the Ford's Max, which had a lower rear roof line, external cosmetic differences and only child seats in the third row. In June 2006. Preface Lift, 2006-2010, Face Lift, 2010-2015. The new Galaxy is larger than its predecessor, and is a four-pillar vehicle of Ford design, with no Volkswagen Group content. Ford sold its stake in Auto Europa back to Volkswagen Group the year before. No longer produced at the Auto Europa plant in Portugal, Europe's 1.8 L Duratec TDSi i4 2.0 L Duratec TDSi i4 2.2L Duratec TDSi i4 Transmission 6-speed manual 6-speed 6F35 automatic 6-speed 6DCT 450 dual clutch dimensions wheelbase 2,850mm 112.2 in length 4,820mm 189.8 in width 1,885mm 74.2 in Bojanin version, 2007-2011 1925mm, 75.8 in 2011-2012 Bojanin 
1930 mm, 76.0 in. Height 1,725 mm, 67.9 in. Curb weight 1,697,1841 kg, 1 3,741,459 pound. Bojanin version, 1,774,1908 kg. 3,911, 4,206 pound. Replacement Galaxy is assembled at a newly re-equipped plant alongside the Mondeo in Genk, Belgium. With THES Max catering to customers who require a sport-oriented multi-purpose vehicle, MPV, Ford was able to expand Galaxy in every dimension without losing sales in size conscious Europe. Due to its size, Ford was unable to design the Galaxy a Singapore kinetic design format. However, Ford stated that the MK2 Galaxy has elements of kinetic design such as its trapezoidal grille, large wheel arches and angular headlights. The vehicle has no spare wheel, instead an aerosol foam sealant is provided to seal punctures until a new tire can be purchased. Only Ford's own engines are used, all diesels being from the Duratic family of engines in 100 PS, 74 kW, 99 bhp, and 125 PS, 92 kW, 123 bhp, 1.8 liter format and also 130 PS, 96 kilowatts, 128 bhp, and 140 PS, 103 kilowatts, 138 bhp, 2.0 TDSI versions, with 2.2 TDSI for more power. Tup patrol engines are now offered. There is the 1.6 T160 Seco Boost Start Forward Slash Stop and the 2.0 203 PS Echo Boost, 14. However the 1.6 liter EcoBoost engine has been criticized by the independent writer Jamie Merrill. He describes the engine as not powerful enough and should have been left in the smaller cars. 15. In the United Kingdom. The MK2 Galaxy was available in Edge, Zetec, and gear trim levels. In February, 2008, Ford added the titanium high-level trim in common with the Focus, C-Max, Cougar, Mondeo and S-Max ranges. The titanium model is specified to the same level as the gear but adds a techno feel. At the same time, the availability of a 175 PS, 129 kilowatts, 173 bhp, 2.2 TDSI engine option, joint design with PSA, was announced. The current trim levels available in the United Kingdom, November, 2011, are Zetec, Titanium and Titanium X. The Ford Galaxy also comes with many features such as home safe lighting quick clear heated windscreen and a cooled passenger glove box. 16. One major selling point of the Galaxy and S Max is the fold flat system. This design allows the second and third row seats to fold flat into the floor, although this change in seating design reduces the load carrying capacity of the vehicle. This model of car is known as the main vehicle on the British television series Outnumbered which replaces the Vauxhall Zafira the family had in the older series. Third generation, CD390, 2015. Third generation, MK4. After its sibling, the Ford S Max, was presented at the 2014 Paris Motor Show. The all-new Galaxy went on sale in mid-2015.17. 2018 Ford Galaxy Titanium XTD Psi 2.0 Front. JPG Preface Lift 2015 2020 Overview Production June 2015 April 2023 Assembly Spain Olmasafs Ford Valencia Plant Body and Chassis Platform for CD4 Platform Related for S Max Second Generation 
Ford Edge, second generation. Lincoln MKZ, second generation. Lincoln Nautilus, first generation. Ford Mondeo, fourth generation. Powertrain engine petrol. 1.5 L EcoBoost Turbo I4. 2.0 L EcoBoost Turbo I4. Petrol hybrid. 2.5 L Duratec I4. Diesel. 2.0 L Duratec TDSI I4. 2.0 L Echo Blue TDSI I4. 2.0 L Echo Blue Twin Turbo I4. Electric motor 133 PS, 98 kilowatts, 131 HP. Permanent magnet 3 phase AC synchronous traction motor transmission 6 speed manual 6 speed 6 F35 automatic Dura shift CVT automatic. Preface lift 2015 2020. Face lift 2020 The Galaxy is available with the same range of engines as the S Max, namely one a diesel, in four states of tune and to petrol variants. The Petrol 1.5 Stico Boost has 160 HP, and the larger 2.0 SC Tie has 240 HP, but can only be mated to Ford S Power Shift Automatic Box. At launch, Ford expected only 2% of United Kingdom sales to petrol models. 3. All the diesels average over 50 miles per gallon the most economical being the 2.0 TD side Euratic 120, WIC manages 57 miles per gallon. Both the 2.0 TD Psi 150 and 180 versions come with either a 6-speed manual gearbox or the PowerShift Auto. The 180 HP version can also be specied with AWD. The range topping by Turbo 2.0 TD Psi 210 comes with the power shift gearbox only, and can accelerate from 0 to 60 in under 9 seconds. The trim levels, mirroring those available in the S Max Mondeo and Edge, include Zetec, Titanium and Titanium X. Mid-cycle facelift. Ford updated the Galaxy for the 2020 model year. It received a new front grille and bumpers with a similar design as the Mondeo, Focus, Fiesta, Puma and Cougar. The Galaxy also received the Vinale version, a new automatic transmission and an updated infotainment system with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. 18, 19, Hybrid Update. 6 speed 6 DCT 450 dual clutch hybrid driver train FHEV, Galaxy Hybrid. Battery 1.1 kWh lithium-ion battery dimensions wheelbase 2.850 mm, 112.2 in, length 4.853 mm, 191.1 in, width 1.916 mm, 75.4 in, height 1.811 mm, 71.3 in, curb weight 1.978 kg. 4,361 pound, hybrid. In late 2021, Ford stopped selling the standard petrol and diesel models, only selling it with one engine choice, a 2.5-liter hybrid Duratec, producing 190 PS with a Duroshift CVT transmission. 20. Discontinuation. In January 2022, Ford announced plans to discontinue Galaxy after 27 years of production, stopping accepting orders for minivan in favor of realization of existing ones. Afterwards cars will be axed from European lineup without direct successor. 2. Reviews The 2012 Ford Galaxy was reviewed by what car and was given 4 out of 5 stars. They added that the Galaxy was more fun to drive than most MPVs. 21. Top Gear also reviewed the car and gave it 7 tenths and added it looked great all around. 22. References. Pay Night, Miracha, the 26th of August. Good. Did finish this in uh, two parts. 
Godt tak på start og kom mega video. Og en take a break. Then start upload this. Then I can make a video in English to make my first video in English about uh, cars. Then I could do it uh, my language Danish. It's 11 p.m. Now my computer did crash. Now the sun is shining, so now it's getting uh, hotter in my apartment. Like 30 degrees. But uh, I will do that. I will uh, take a break, upload this, and try to make a video in English about this for the Galaxy. Uh, 